Growing up in South America, former Buccaneers player Martin Gramatica had dreams of playing in the World Cup, not just the Super Bowl. Yeah, so the job took him in a different direction, but as 10 Tampa Bay Sports Director Evan Klosky shows you, now he is getting back to his roots with a brand new team right here in Tampa Bay. Martin Gramatica always knew his future relied on his feet. The attempt is good. In All-American in college, All-Pro in the NFL, and eventual Super Bowl champion with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. In high school, he committed his career to football. Once you're done with the bands, there are two lines, yes. But his heart quick, 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 quick. was always another kick away. Play, play, play. Orange out, orange out. Gray, stay in. Job keep. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Focus now. When you get start to get tired, let's start the focus. I, I grew up playing soccer. I'm originally from Argentina, so soccer was my first passion. At 47 years old, his days in cleats are done. Roger, how you doing, man? Good. That doesn't mean he can't be on the field, though. Now to be able to come back and you know start with uh, as as a coach with a pa the, the the sport that I love, uh, I just can't can't be more thankful. Gramatica is the first head coach of the Tampa Bay Strikers, a new team in a new league. The NISL, or National Indoor Soccer League, is currently at five teams, and all organizations have a men's and women's squad to root for on the turf. This is a great opportunity. How about it? Games are played in the Yingling Center on the campus of USF, but practices are here at Cinco Soccer in East Tampa, a much different picture than what we're used to seeing. For a casual soccer fan or even a non-soccer fan, this is like hockey soccer. So there's a lot of scoring, a lot of very fast pace because the ball rarely goes out of bounds. You have the power play, the blue car, you sit two minutes, uh, the shootout. It's a transition for the coaching staff. Don't worry about being offside because there's no offside rule, so just keep going. And the players. I mean, if you watch the first game, it's literally just go, 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 go. On this day, Tessa McKibben is one of 40 strikers squeezing in practice at sunrise before their full-time jobs start later that morning. We have girls that drive from Sarasota. Like, you're getting up at 5 to drive for an hour and a half soccer practice. It's the continued commitment to competition. Yes, good job. One Martine has never given up on, just like Nico Miola. Nico, you good? Yes. Good job. Man. Who now works for a nonprofit philanthropy after retiring from the sport. It's an honor to come out here and, and compete. It's a privilege to, you know, some of us are former student athletes, so the fact that we still have the opportunity is pretty awesome. It certainly helps having a former Super Bowl champion provide legitimacy to a budding league. Probably one of the most professional coaches that I've dealt with personally in all of my career. He always says he does not enjoy losing, and, and we're trying to kind of instill that same mentality within the whole group. Nothing's personal. We just have to figure out the best 12 that helps us win the game. For a man who made his living kicking a ball. The 43-yard attempt by Gramatica. And winning a title in the process. And let's play, let's play. His hope is to have others doing the same. I may have a side job, but my side job's secondary. Now I can make money playing soccer. That's the goal, to so get it to where they can make a good living playing indoor soccer in their hometown. From Cinco Soccer, good, Skyler. Evan Klosky. Come on, Abdullah, why's your ball everywhere, man? 10 Tampa Bay. Up, 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 up. Good, good, good. If you've never caught an indoor soccer game, they are fun to watch, a little intense, too. As soon as you said hockey, soccer, it clicks You're for like, me. Right, yep, I'm I know in. exactly, yeah. Martin says uh, the NISL is hoping to expand from five to nearly a dozen teams next season. If you want to see the Tampa Bay Strikers play, the next home game is February 26th. Coming up, we do have a link to tickets on our website right now, 10tampabay.com.